I'm going to show you how to remove a uh, carter pin from an old style crank. Uh, this is a 1969 Raleigh bike, so this bike is about 45 years old, and as far as I know, this pin has never been removed. Um, and so I've, I've attempted to remove it a couple times, just a little bit, and it's pretty in there. So I'm going to show you how to remove a very uh, hard to remove uh, carter pin. First, uh, you want to go ahead and um, loosen this nut over here. And if there's enough threading, which on this one there's not, what you would want to do is uh, leave the nut and leave like a few, uh, two or three threads worth of space in there between the nut and the crank. Unfortunately, this one doesn't come out enough. So I'm going to have to just go right against the uh, end of the pin there, the threaded port. Okay, next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take some uh, penetrating oil and I'm going to spray it in here around the threaded part and try to get some of that in there. And I'm going to let that soak for about 15 minutes. And another thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a hammer and I'm going to tap in around the crank here. in towards the bike and hopefully get it to loosen up the pin a little bit on this, this little spindle in there. Just tap it in. And then we'll go ahead and let that soak. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a vise, and I have it set up on some blocks so that the jaws are the same level as the pin. And I have a half inch socket, or you can use whatever size socket you uh, have, but I want to fit this over the non-threaded side of the pin. And I want to have enough room inside the socket for the pin to be able to push into the socket. So I'm going to set the vise up against the threaded side there and against the socket, and then tighten down the uh, vise onto there and hopefully this is going to push the the pin through the crank into the socket and I'm just going to tighten this down and I'm going to use a cheater bar to allow me to get this really tight. I'm going to tighten this down and tighten it a little bit more And I got the pin loose. And the crank will come right off. And that is how you get a hard to remove carter pin out of a crank. Hope that helps.